quality over quantity. And one of the things that we're trying to do, we started a, re we started a record label on the side to kind of impress upon um, the people around us of this quality over quantity philosophy where you go in, you give it your best effort, and you make decisions, and then you live with those decisions. And one of the things that's seriously degraded the quality that Vance uh, brought up was this infinite ability to do recall and things like that, which when you're doing anything, there's a compromise. So uh, in a situation where you have infinite recall, you're sacrificing quality because you're generally not able to do total recall on a quality mixing console. It's impossible without fixtures. So you're either doing in the box or whatever. You have a board that you can do recall on like with, with too many channels. The other thing that a lot of people don't realize is when you're mixing anything, whether it's analog or digital, the more channels you have, the less resolution your final mix is going to have. In the digital domain, the more you attenuate a signal, the more you lose resolution. So every time you turn something down 6 dB, you're losing a bit of resolution. So if you have a signal at minus 18, you're already at 21 bits of resolution. So if you turn, keep turning it down, 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 you're losing resolution. People wonder why in-the-box mixes don't sound as good a lot of times. Well, it's improved now with floating point, but back in fixed point, you're losing resolution. So if you have a giant console with a million, you can't just keep adding things without losing something. So every time you add a channel to your mix, you are degrading the resolution of the mix in general. So going back again to why older stuff sounds better a lot of times is they were mixing four tracks or eight tracks or 16 or 24. And so the quality was always of the utmost. It was quality over quantity. Every track, every channel sounded great and they weren't combining that many channels.